All right. Uh, good evening, everyone, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, before we uh, end this Sunday and uh, greet the day that everyone, uh, not like the day that everyone disliked or everyone's least favorite day, like you said, Leon. Uh, let's stream some Sengoku Gubas Earthly Utage and finish up uh, the last two characters for Hero Story. So, hello, Leon. Hello, Pemburu Vampir. Are they brothers? No, Hide Yoshiaki and Hideaki are not brothers. They have the they have different tertiary names. Uh, Mogami Yoshiaki and Kobayakawa Hideaki. Yeah, I mean, their names kind of rhyme, right? Yoshiaki, Hideaki. <laughs> oh, by the way, I can run the P RPCSP version. Nice! Uh, it's good to go. Like, it's good to hear that. I, I do want to, like, try out the... RPCSP version of Seiyuu Basara 3 Utage and Basara Summer Heroes. I can run Basara Force and Ragi on RPCSP and it runs smooth like a baby's ass. I, I may need uh, I may need a different terminology. Sorry, I may need a different terminology one day, but I'm going to go with that terminology or analogy. Smooth as a baby's ass until I found a better analogy. So yeah, um, Yoshiaki and Hideaki. Yoshi uh, both are, uh, you know, joke characters, you can say. I do like the balance in Hero Story, so you got four characters like Kojuro, Sasuke, Matsunaga, and Tenkai as the quote-unquote serious characters. Then you got Muneshige, Sorin, uh, Yoshiaki, and Hideaki as the joke characters where their story are just uh, a bunch of fooling around and uh, lols. Yeah, so we're gonna finish the, the Hero Story tonight for the entire characters, so we will finish the last two characters and the next streams, the next six streams, are going to be characters that return in Basara Fiyutage but did not have a story. Which are Kenshin, Shingen, Kasuga, Toshie, Matsu, and Ujimasa. And finally then, we I want to take a break from Seiyuu Basara in general and play another ga other games uh, for this channel. And also make other videos as well because, oh my goddamn, my script and my video editing still needs a long way to go because I was just absolutely lazy and uh, disorganized when it comes to YouTube content and my other stuff that I need to cover, but it is what it is. Hopefully I'm, I'm trying to get it as soon as possible before I delay it for a longer period. So yeah, um, thank you guys so much for joining this night. So without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. <laughs> That's a long introduction, Yoshiaki. Wagahai wa kouki na kitsune! Sugokte! Kashikoi! Sono ue ni! Yuga de totte mo steki na! Deomin tachi no akogare no mato! Kose ni nao no kosu koto machigai na shi no idai na ushu tandai! Mogami Yoshiaki de aru! Kore wa sonna Mogami Yoshiaki ni yoru. Hello, Brandon, the guy that looks like a joke, but his skill is deceptively good. I always say this, um, Brandon. He's basically Basar's version of Yuan Shao. And hello, Share 18. Yeah, I've been doing well. I'm s I am ending my Sunday with Sengoku Basar Fiyutage. You know, people say Monday is everybody's least favorite day. I actually prefer Mondays over Sundays. Just saying, unless there's something interesting going on in Sunday. Oh, was he an attack boost? Uh, um, let's use Masamune as our bodyguard. His nephew. Also, we are in 793 subscribers. Thank you guys so much. At which point you can play, uh, can you play as two characters in one battle? Uh, can you play as two characters in one battle? Uh, I think you need to finish the hero story to unlock that tag team mode. And hello, random black guy! Glad you can stop by.
あの奥方殿を人質にして前田を東軍に組み入れるそれを手柄に我が輩は家康君に一目置かれ王子を頂戴するさすが我が輩見事で素晴らしい作戦<笑>さあ誘拐されてくれた前松殿我が輩の超絢爛本物行動開始He's really fun to play. Matsu the Sailor Moon girl. Uh, I want to see his move first. Yeah, I want to see. So, okay, this is normal attack. I like his hold square. Okay, have you played Samurai Warriors? If so, which one is your favorite? Sengoku Basara or Samurai Warriors? I'm gonna say Sengoku Basara. Sengoku Basara all the win. Um, I like Dynasty Warriors, Samurai Warriors, but when it comes to combat, Sengoku, ba Sengoku Basara wins. I just like how in-depth uh, the combat is in Sengoku Basara 3, especially in 4. And not to mention... Sengoku Basara, like Capcom with Sengoku Basara, not only did the combat better, but it did everything else better in terms of like presentation, character design. It's just very colorful and vibrant. Samurai Warriors always lean towards the realistic, and let's. I'm sorry, let's be honest here. I don't play video games for realism. Reach, yeah. And I, I kind of don't like uh, that some Koei, like, not saying everyone, but uh, some people I've seen in the Koei community kind of downplays or undermines uh, how good Sengoku Basara is. Just because it's not realistic or it's too anime. Like, I, I don't even consider that as an argument at this point. Like, if you're just gonna shit on Basara because it's anime, then you're just downplaying for the sake of downplaying. You're just, you're just being a dick at that point. Lee22, welcome. It's been a while, brother. I'll ignore that. Ignore what? Ignore what, Brandon? Oh, you mean? Oh, you're talking about the meme. Uh, uh freeze a quote, yeah. Uh, I don't consider this as a Dynasty Wars clone. It's a Muso like game, but I don't consider it as a clone of that I, I don't really like the word clone that's like saying uh tokiden is a monster hunter clone it's a monster hunter like game wild card is a monster hunter like game but it's not a clone yoshiaki also has my last two brain cells on math exams when koi fanboy see basara i'll ignore that like, I, I know some people say Basara combat is too simplistic, like Dynasty Warriors 7 and 8, and they only play Devil Kings and Sego Basara 1. I feel like that's very disingenuous when people do that. Like, I'm not saying people should like Basara. I, I don't mind if, like, some people would, uh... Yeah, Basara is not their cup of tea because of certain, uh certain things i mean i there are a lot of games that i don't like because of certain things it's not my cup of tea but i don't uh at, at the very least i'm not trying to downplay their importance or the good things they do they do have for example i'm not a fan of the last of us i don't think the last of us is very much appealing for me in some aspects i kind of think the last of us is overrated but i do i do understand the appeal of the last of us and why it's very like um, and why it's very... how do I say it? it? It's very captivating for a lot of gamers. The story... The story is good, like it's very cinematic and it gets you emotional. But personally, I may... like, if, if I'm immersed myself... I'm, Im I'm immersed... how do I say it? To me, video games are more than just stories. If I... if I 
play video games only for this for the story. I'm I'm just gonna watch the cutscenes or a movie. <laughs> the main reasons why uh, the main reason why I immerse myself in video game is because of the gameplay. I still prefer, prefer Dice Wars and Samurai Wars probably because Sengu Basa is less serious. I mean, you know, more power to you. More power to you. Like, I mean, a point, like, uh, this is like a different topic, but. I'm trying to be uh, like as someone who makes content. I mean, I mean, I, I recognize I'm a, I'm a small content creator. I'm just a nobody at the end of the day, and like I'm fully recognize that. But I'm in a point right now, like um, I'm trying to give my opinions on certain things if I like or dislike something. But I'm trying to explain in a way that I don't downplay what's uh, what's good about the other, uh, what's good about the things that I don't like. Like, for example, Dynasty Wars 4 is a game I do not like okay or i liked it less as time goes by however there are a lot of things that dynasty wars 4 did right did actually do good and do right and i, I tried to not downplay that fact for example um people when i say i think dynasty wars 4 is overrated in a subjective uh, term because of uh, certain things i don't like people say oh you need to understand dynasty wars 4 is the like the best selling uh, muso game for koi Yes, that's correct, and I'm not, like, I'm not ignoring, or I'm not, uh, how do I say it? I am not downplaying that fact whatsoever. However, just because it's the best-selling uh, Dynasty Wars game, or Musou game in for Koei Tecmo, it doesn't change the fact that I don't like the game as, uh, as much as uh, everyone else. Oh yeah, I, I play Boss on a one over Dynasty Wars 2 in any day of the week. There's not even a like a there's not even a there's not even a question for me. Uh, the, the kind of like dangerous thing uh, when you are on the internet sometimes, whether you are a content creator or you're not a content creator, is that the more time you spend on the internet. The more time you grow, like you grow your ego and a sense of self, uh, like a sense of self entitlement. Like for example, you um, you have the need to in, to be super entitled to your opinion to the point where you have to shit like to have, you have to shit talk people who uh, uh, who has a different opinion than yours just to look cool or just to you know get a brownie point from the internet. And to be honest, I was in that phase as well. Like. A lot of you guys already know, I used to shit talk on Chris Gildart because I don't share his opinion. And right now, uh, I, now I talk a lot with Chris Gildart when it comes to like warrior stuff or even certain personal stuff. It's crazy how things work, you know, sometimes. Like, it, it, when it comes to, like, opinions, like, you can have an opinion without be, uh, having an ego. And I feel like, um, it's something I'm constantly trying to do. It, it's not an easy thing to do, but it's something that you need to do. Like, it's like, I saw other, like, content creators in the Koei community that I really, like, enjoy, uh, that I really enjoy watching. Like, Lighty, Chris Gildart, Night Owl. I feel like they, they apply that, uh, they apply the... Uh, how do I say that mindset as well? Like you can have an opinion on something, but not be an asshole, or like not develop a sense of entitlement to your opinion, and like understand uh, at the very least, if you don't share an opinion, try to understand uh, uh, the other side of like uh, the spectrum who don't share an opinion or like share a different opinion, because try like try to think uh, how do they try to think in their perspective, because I I've been there as well where. I, I have a certain opinion on opinion or cert, of certain things, and because I have those opinions, I say I like certain things, and a lot of people downplay uh, my opinions or like calling me stupid or like yeah, you're stupid or yeah, like you're you're a retard or you're living in the mar your mom's basement or like you just even to the point where I someone said I deserve to die or something. Yeah, it, it's never pleasant. Like 
and like here's the thing trollings uh, trolls are just trolls uh, you don't uh, take those words seriously but it's not a pleasant thing regardless when someone downplays your opinion so I, I tried to at least uh, like I, I tried to how do I, okay, I, I, this is why English is not my first language I tried to give my personal take on something, but not downplaying uh, the other side of the spectrum when it comes to opinions. Yeah, exactly. I like Dynasty Wars, and people say, oh, it's just a... It's just a button-mashing... Button uh, it's just a button-mashing uh, 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 extravaganza, which I don't think it is. And I can give reasons why it's not, but when people, uh, where, but at the same time, I feel like convincing those people is gonna be a waste of time because they already have their mindset. Like, uh, you can't convince someone who's, uh, you can't. How do I say it? You cannot convince someone who is ready to misunderstood you, or who is not willing to understand your side of, uh, your side of like a. Uh, your side of the uh, spectrum or your opinion or you, you cannot convince people who's just gonna downplay you so I say ignore those people <laughs> I, I just ignore those people and not to mention it's the internet like when it comes to the internet, everything that you said will be used against you. Like, I can talk about uh, respecting opinions right now, right? And people will quote this and then gonna find out something I said two or three years uh, ago and then use it, oh yeah, Profar is a hypocrite. Like, I've grown, uh, I, I've grown to accept that fact that people are constantly trying to look something you say on the internet and turn it against you. Hey, uh, Brainer, welcome. I agree with you about video games in general. I don't play them for the stories. If you want the story, I'd rather watch a movie or read books. Exactly. Uh, I started blasting a Zavi. Have you seen Sex Gravy's new tier list? Which one? The Sengoku Basara games? I've seen it. I've seen his uh, Sengoku Basara games tier list and his um, Sengoku Basara characters tier list. It's unfortunate that he put Matsunaga very low. And he put a tear above Matsunaga, but it is what it is. Oh, Sego Basa Fiyutage Sages. Okay. I've been speaking English, no worries. I've been speaking English in my whole life, and I still don't understand. Guilty until proven innocent, yeah. And it's not like what I said is like. Like, here's the thing. Um. Yeah, I, I'm talking a lot of nonsense at this point. Like, I'm talking from one topic to another, but whatever. It is what it is. That's what a live stream is for, to engage with your audience. And I like to talk anyway, so... That's a plus. That's a bonus. I, I, um, I talked about cancel culture with my friends a couple of days ago, uh, and... Um, I have an experience with cancel culture. I'm not gonna mention names here, but I have a certain friend who is a content creator who said, who once warned me that I should uh, make a statement towards a certain political. I'm not sure if I can say it here, honestly. A certain political. Uh, uh, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna say it how it is. Uh, he said, uh, um, I should be careful because I might get cancelled by people who support LGBT on that and that kind of things. And I told him, people are gonna cancel me regardless how I, uh, my stance on LGBT. Like, I'm a gaming content creator. Like, who's gonna take my word seriously when it comes to politics or identity politics anyways? And the thing is, when it comes to like gaming content creator, like most people who uh, who watch me, they're gonna watch me for the gaming content. I don't want to bring up politics in or like identity politics in my content. Maybe I I bring some takes that uh, based on what my opinion and my experience is. But in general, this um, what is it? This uh, this channel, this community is a gaming community. 
and uh, people said I, I need to make statements in regards to political uh, identity politics or something because people might cancel me. I said I'm, I, I'm not afraid of cancel culture, honestly. Like cancel culture, the thing with cancel culture is that it's not about um, accountability. It's really just about public shaming. And in the long run, cancel culture does jack shit. I give example. I know I use this example a lot. Look at EDB for War 5. He was cancelled in 2021 for about a year. And now he's back on the internet, he's back on YouTube, and he's still making content. Uh, like cringe content. Because even though he was cancelled two years or like a year or two ago. And why is that? Because he never faced any accountability of the things that he, do he did. Because... And I've stated in previous live streams before, because people are too busy fooling around with uh, <coughs> with evidence of you know um, uh, grooming, minor grooming, instead of like actually involving the uh, the law enforcement, people fool around and milk drama content on that on that on EDP. As a result. He's not taking accountability, he's just getting uh, like a one or two year of internet cancellation and it, it, that's it. He's back on the internet, he's uh, just, he's doing what he did, like, he's doing as if nothing happened to him. Nobunaga next? I already did Nobunaga in uh, Basar 3, random black guy, in like uh, Samurai Heroes. So I'm just covering uh, the characters that uh, are not in Basar Samurai Heroes. Yeah, and another, uh, because, uh, Brainer brought up, brought this up to me, Manx, the Fire Emblem content creator, he was cancelled because of his interaction with a girl on a hotel room. Yeah, cancelled for, like, a couple of months, and then he started streaming again, and as if nothing happens. Like, cancel culture, like, here's the thing about cancel culture, is that... I don't think anyone would be cancelled if you don't break your character. Uh, it, that's what Asmongold always said. You'll never be cancelled if you if you expose this, like if you expose yourself as a uh, contradictory to what your character online is. If that makes sense. Like for example, if your character online is all about calling out child predators, is about like uh, calling out sex predators, and then you were uh, exposed of, let's say, grooming a minor or like touching a girl in certain areas in public, then you're, go you're gonna get cancelled because that's not your character. People found out who you really are. Yeah, I can't believe my favorite uh, gaming channel doesn't want to talk about economic state of the world. That's an interesting idea, to be honest. Uh, oh, a tier list of uh, Basara stages? Anyway, I'm, I'm getting out of tension. Why am I talking about this? I'm, I'm talking from a video game opinions to cancel culture. I mean, I mean, it's the internet at the end of the day. You know, I've, I've read a lot of things about me uh, when I made that. Uh, you know, I keep talking about that video, but whatever. It's it's my it's my stream. It's my channel. I can say whatever I want at the end of the day. And all of you uh, who agrees with me, good with it. All of you who disagree with me, just sit down, look pretty, and watch me. Like, oh, uh, I, I I like I joke about oh I'm gonna get canceled because like I'm gonna get people to riot because I said Dynasty Wars 4 is overrated or he's not my favorite. And I, I've seen some people saying, oh, you're not, like, you're just a nobody with uh, less than 1k subs. You can't be cancelled. To that I say, good. That means I can say whatever I want. <laughs> I was really interested to join in, in the bar where we talk about Commander. Oh yeah, we've been like 
We've been uh, diving deep to the world of Tokusatsu, especially Kamen Rider. Two days ago, we, uh, me, Alex, Brandon, and Turki, uh, we watched Kamen Rider Agito. Seven episodes of Agito, by the way. A lot of episodes of Agito. And Saturday, me and uh, Turki, uh, we watch two episodes of Kamen Rider Kuga. この我が輩がここまで頼んだというのにもう我慢の限界だ。いいよ。我が輩の超ドリュー角割り55号。街道のを捉えるのだ。出てくる場所が違うではないか。Ouch, Mogami just got drilled in his butthole. <laughs> not the first thing, not the thing I want to see tonight, but okay. Uh, the best part of content creation is when you are on the smaller side because you'll be able to enjoy everything even more. Oh yeah, absolutely. Hell, uh, I, I said this as well, like... Um, Kamen Rider, like, uh, we, we were talking about Kamen Rider Tokusatsu. Like, compared to, like... A lot of people on the internet, especially on the Western side, they don't know, uh, like, they don't know about Kamen Rider or other Tokusatsu. They just see it, oh, it's just another Power Rangers show, when it's not. And it's less popular on the inter- well, again, on the Western side of the internet, but it's very- I mean, Kamen Rider is very popular here in Indonesia, but a lot of things that are niche or less popular in certain, like, for a certain audience, I get to enjoy those more because they are less popular. Like. It's because, like, for example, Sengu Basa is not as popular as uh, Dynasty Wars in the Warriors community, but the fact that I can make content on this because it's less popular, I get to enjoy this even more, and I get to share what I, like, I get to share something really good and not as popular as, like, and, and maybe not a lot of people know about. That's the, like, that's the, that's the beauty about uh, niche titles or niche things is get you like because not a lot of people know about this thing you get to enjoy more and you're uh, since you are one of the few people who understand or one of the few people who enjoy it you get to enjoy it more and you get to appreciate it as time goes by same goes with Sengoku Basara Sengoku Basara Commander a lot of niche uh, niche titles for TV shows and games uh, like, like let's start with games right? Sengoku Basara like I said it, it's not as popular as uh other warriors get like a uh, of the Koei Warriors games, or Dynasty, or Samurai, or Orochi. But the beauty about that is that I can talk about Sengu Basara all day and, uh, and like, in a way, influence some people who are not familiar with Sengu Basara uh, to see, hey, Sengu Basara is actually really good. You know, I can tell these people Sengu Basara is actually really good. And some of them uh, would, uh, some of them uh, try it out and it's like, oh my god, it is right. Like, uh, how come we never know about this? Oh. They, they did a lot of, like, they did the combat a lot better than a lot of uh, Omega Force Warriors or Koei Warriors games. And it's, it's a shame that not a lot of people knew about this because mostly a Japanese exclusive. But that's for video games. Like, a lot of video games that I appreciate and I like and I get to share it with other people who are not familiar with are Japanese exclusive and they became invested to it. For example, not just Sengoku Basara. Panzer Bandit is an amazing beat em up game on the PS1. It was quite popular here in Indonesia. I get to like share, I get to share Panzer Bandit to a lot of pe uh, some people in the Discord, some friends I know, and they saw it as like, damn, this is actually really good. Panzer Bandit, um, a lot of the Kamen Rider games, Gear Fighter Dendo on the PS1, another very underrated uh, video game, Naruto Clash of Ninja, a, a very uh, a mostly obscure Naruto fighting game. They get to like, uh, I get to appreciate these more, and I get to share 
I get to share them to people who are not familiar with. Some people will downplay it, but who cares about them? Uh, who ca if, if some people just gonna downplay it, it's like whatever. But it, the, uh, there are there are more people who are gonna be like appreciated as you appreciate it if you have the passion for it. Again, like common writer, I like uh, with, uh, this correlates with the uh, about downplaying opinions. I I love common writer. Okay, I, I I'm uh, like. As, as I grow older, I'm still a Kamen Rider fanboy in heart, really. I get to share Kamen Rider Agita to some friends on Discord. I get to share Kamen Rider Kuga, I get to share Kamen Rider Fize, because those are my favorites. And when they first saw Kamen Rider, at first they were like, oh, Kamen Rider is probably just another Power Ranger show. And then when I, when I actually showed shows like Kuga, Agito, Fize, it was like, holy sh- like, wow, this is like, this is not what I thought it was. I thought this was gonna be another Power, Power Rangers. And, when they, especially Kuga, it was like how dark the the show is, like monsters actually killing people, and some of the scenes are can be considered brutal for for a quote unquote kid show. But that's the thing, like, um, that that's the thing. When it comes to like uh, as a comic writer, as a Tokusatsu fan, people downplay me. Okay, people say, oh, you're you're just watching kid shows because like. It's so cheesy on like uh it's just another Power Rangers show. And I'm not like I don't have the need to convince these people, these people as well, who's just gonna downplay my opinion or like misunderstood me. Because they're they're already in their head. Like they already have a like have a mindset in their head that's never gonna change. But the thing is, uh, I'm gonna like I can still appre like I can still appreciate these shows, I can still appreciate comedy, I can show uh, people who might appreciate it. Uh, that's the thing with like enjoying something that is not as popular as a lot like not as popular as a lot of mainstream uh, media shows or media in general. You get what I'm saying here. I, again, English is not my first language and sometimes I might say something out of my ass or whatever. I'm just a <laughs> I'm just a video game content creator at the end of the day. Did you know Kuga's first two episodes has remastered CJ for the henshin sequence? Oh, I don't know that. Uh, you learn more every day. Every day. And Yoshiaki was never the same ever again. Whew. Ah, that's an understatement. Amazed the drill uh, machine didn't uh, crush her while picking her up. Ah, uh, because Sega Kubasa characters have, um, have plot armor or something. Man, I'm thankful. Sorry, man, I'm thankful that I got to experience something like Common Rider. It was so much fun. Oh yeah, absolutely. Common Rider is amazing. Like, of course, like the current Common Rider is not the same as uh, the Common Rider that I watched as a kid. But you know, things need to evolve. Like, Common Rider needs to evolve at some point. Like, or it needs to change at some point. Like, you cannot have Common Rider Kuga for the. <laughs> For like 25 years in a row, like you cannot have uh, the same style, the same tone for uh, 20 years plus. You need to change in some ways. Now, Kamen Rider is flashier. Like it, it's flashier. It's more, you can say lighthearted. It has some like deep aspect on it, but it's a little bit more lighthearted compared to like your Kuga, Agito, Yuki, or Vice. But again, it's a it's a different experience. It's a different audience. It's a different direction that they're going for and I'm, I'm i'm actually trying to enjoy it i i for some reason i haven't watched gotch heart i kind of need to i kind of want to i kind of need to watch gotch heart again just because like every time i stream gotch heart it's always buffering something's always fucking up sure 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 uh post that video前だけお仲間入りさせたすんごい功績。これを Oh yeah, Kamen Rider influenced so much Japanese media. 
Oh, Sekigahara? Okay. The thing I like about, like, the older Kamen Rider shows is that, uh, one of the things, at least, it's like what Brandon said, it's the Yakuza style, as in, like, some scenes can be really dark, deep, and serious, and then the next scene is just goofing around. Like Agito, for example. You got one scene, uh, where someone is being brutally killed by a, by a monster or an unknown. And then the next scene, you see Soichi fingering uh, fishes. Dude literally flew into a whole different fight. And I'm gonna use this weapon. Penetration. Uh, yeah, I want to fly. Okay, I want to have flying abilities without having my butthole penetrated with a drill nonetheless Yeah, exactly Yakuza games can switch from whimsical tone to very serious and the other way around yes, Like you can have a serious scene between let's say Ichiban and Kiryu and then the next scene you'll see Monkeys riding uh, forklifts or bulldozers. <laughs> it's basically the Celestial uh, 100 Crack Fist, but with a sword. Okay, that's the counter move. Yeah, exactly. Sengo Basar does that as well. Like, in Fuyutage, you have Kojiro's story that is uh, serious and grounded, and then you have Yoshiaki that's just goofing around. Yeah, the dragon's uncle, who is an absolute weasel. ショリの玄米茶を入れたまえ。梅戸のやすやすと I like that move. Look! <laughs> Do it again. Look! Okay, 
を聞き逃すなよ <laughs> Over there, Kasuga is letting him hang out. Look, a naked Kasuga! Oh, where? <laughs> Hello, Sakuya, welcome. Yeah, this battle is really good for stacking up combos. And also leveling up. Oh, that, that's a nice combo for Yoshaki. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Jump! And then goes to R1. I do like uh, Yoshiaki's R1, you can do it on the air. Now, not everyone has a jump R1, but I do like that Yoshiaki has something that Boss R4 absolutely fixed for everyone. Like, almost everyone has a jump R1. Little boy, <laughs> little boy, JK. I mean, he, he's technically he's kind of like a Basar's version of Yuan Shao. Even in uh, Samurai Heroes, he has Yuan Shao's voice. Oh yeah, everyone has a jump R1 in... Well, as far as I'm concerned, it's everyone. <laughs> Tadakatsu wouldn't stand a chance against His Highness. He sounds like Waluigi in Japanese. He kind of has the Waluigi mustache as well. Waluigi, uh, a Mario character. He's the brother of Wario. Gaming Montel! Hello, buddy. Gold, gold everywhere? Absolutely. Uh, this stage is basically an EXP and gold farm. And I love it. Yo, Montel, you have a uh, Steam account, by the way? I mean, we can play. I, 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 I would like to find six players to play uh, TMNT together. If you have that game on PC, let's hook up. Yeah, I do. Nice. He has the voice of Lloyd, the scientist from, scientist from Code Geass. Ah, so, we're playing as two Code Geass characters. Yoshiaki is Lloyd from Code Geass and... Hideaki is Lelouch. Jun Fukuyama is such a good voice actor, by the way. We'll tell 8129. Okay, I'll add you uh, later. Once I'm done. <laughs> After watching Golden Waste, Mario Tegu. 
Uh, nobody understands that reference, JK, unless you're Indonesian. Ayo, Lukake! Six player steering team, let's go! Yeah, I need to find a. I need to find a six uh, teenagers with attitude. Well, five, uh, including my, well, excluding myself, though, that means five, because I'm the sixth teenager. Also, dude, I want a, I want a new Mighty Morphin Power Ranger beat him up. Like, you can play up to six players, that would be dope. Well, you got a sassy old man. <laughs> That'll do. Basara 2 here, Sekiga Heart is good. Yeah, it's good, but... Tadakatsu is a pain in the ass in that game. Alright guys, I'll be right back. Need to open the door. Alright, I'm back. Nidbu said Ntai Harikanger on the PS1 is a great beat-em-up. It's, it's a mix of beat-em-up and fighting game, but I like... That's probably my favorite Sentai game. Nidbu Sentai Harikanger. Now, like I said, I'm not too familiar with Super Sentai, but... I'm familiar with a lot of Super Sentai opening songs. Nidbu Sentai Harikanger is one of them. Like, I... 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 I Boot, not boot, but uh, I play up uh, set high dangerous theme when, like, like when I'm busy at work or something. You know the one that goes shoo shoo to Sanjo. Like, I, 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 I love that. It's a catchy ass song, and I'm never gonna get tired of it. <laughs> Anime Muso games? Absolutely. Oh, we have, well, uh, outside of One Piece Gundam, we kind of have a Naruto Muso game uh, on the PSP, Naruto Ultimate Ninja Impact. <laughs> Harikenja uh, opening might be my favorite Sentai opening. It's hard to pick uh, which one is my favorite opening because I really like a lot of them. I do like a Gosei Sentai Diary Jirs opening. 
Kusei Sentai Dai Renja that one. Uh, it's also my first uh, introduction to Super Sentai, which back in the day I I I kid you not I used to think Super Sentai was I I, I said it in my previous live stream. Uh, I used to think Super Sentai was a copy of Power Ranger, or Japan bought the rights for Power Rangers to create Super Sentai, but it's actually the other way around. Until I, I only figured that out when I found out on the internet, when I was introduced to the internet. Back in like the late 2000s or mid to late 2000s. Oh, Berserk Muso is also white? Jetman Kaku Ranger is my favorite. Oh, yeah, Jetman is it is probably my su favorite Super Sentai series so far. Jetman. I can see why people. Uh, I can see why a lot of people look at Jetman so highly. It is a really good show. Sorry about that. Let's continue. Y y yeah, uh, Dino Thunder. Alright, a thousand KOs. Most Power Rangers themes are bangers, yeah. Lightspeed Rescue is my favorite Power Ranger theme. You know what? Uh, you know what else is a banger, Lukake? Super Sentai music. Super Sentai. It might like. Maybe I'm just a. a I'm just a deep down. I'm just a weeb, but. Super Sentai music are a lot better than Power Rangers music. Not to say Power Ranger music is bad. I like opening themes are bad. I, I like a lot of Power Rangers opening themes, but Super Sentai is better in my opinion. I'm having a blast. People, uh, I'm uh, having fun blasting people with Zabi. Time Force is a good song, Dino Charge is a good song as well. Haha, <laughs> you Toku Sentai. Good one. Ah, good to see uh, Yoshiaki learning some moves from Dante. Oh, my God. 
Hello, we expect 1,000 kills. Need 599901 more. I like Kamen Rider more than Power Rangers or Super Sentai. Same. I mean, I'm I'm a I'm a Kamen Rider guy, uh, through and through. A bit of Ultraman guy back in the day. I love Ultraman Tiga. But I was more invested in Kamen Riders when it comes to Stokusatsu's. And a bit of Godzilla as well. Oh, uh, I was into Godzilla back in the day. You might consider Godzilla as the OG Tokusatsu. Alright, let me finish Yoshia- uh, not Yoshiaki, Yoshitsugu here. Oh, German Nexus is really good? Nice. Unfortunately, I haven't watched Nexus. Uh, Nexus is the one where uh, the story, like, they plan to go on a darker route, right? Well, my favorite when it comes to Ultraman because uh, that's the one I remember watching the most are Ultraman Tiga and Gaia. Yeah, dark as hell. Nice. やれ、腰が抜けた。腰がなければ心理よ。Lightning shot, it's been a while, yeah. Good to see you again. Is the flying guy playable? Yes, Yoshitsu. I played him before. Uh, Mini's back. If you're still here, if you if you are still here, this is my favorite move of Yoshiaki. Wait, his triangle move. Look, look. Yeah, look at there. Barry. And then he does a kick. Look, a naked Kasuga. The sleeping god. Hell <laughs> about. I just like the, the enemy's reaction to it. Let's do this again. Hello, guys. Hey. Look! <laughs> they couldn't handle his kindness trick. Look over there! <laughs> Uh, this reminds me of a scene in Kinnan and Kel, if you guys remember, if you watched Kinnan and Kel back in the day. Yes, I am old enough to remember Kinnan and Kel. There was this funny scene where they were in like a motorcycle bar, and Kinnan was like, Look, the Great Wall of China! And everyone was like staring in the thin air, and uh, Kinnan told Kel like, Hey Kel, let's get out of here. And Kel was like, No, uh, wait man, I I'm looking at the Great Wall of China. And Kinnan was like, There is no Great Wall of China! <laughs> and everyone, and all the like, the motorcycle gang started, what the fuck? Look at that. 
make it cost go yeah he looks like waluigi yeah uh, while in english dub again he's waluigi mixed with uh, yuan shao Yes, naked Kasuga. <laughs> you are Luigi. Silly guy. Yep. Look, a naked Kasuga. Right, got got all the bases. Now to time to beat up uh, Mitsunari and Iyasu. This one, his sword looked like a small buster sword. Yeah, this is his second weapon. A small buster, yeah, <laughs> cloud small buster sword, but it's small and ice. <laughs> Look, a good Muso gamer. <laughs> oh, hey. Ah, not close enough. Ah, there we go. Oh, judgment. Nice. この yeah, it's the Yakuza like game. I'm not sure if Brandon have played that. Gintama Muso game? Yeah, I, uh, I, Gintama Rumble. Ah, 
振り仕切るあの瞬間へ Oh, really? It's emulatable what? Gintama Rumble? Yeah, I might try PSV to emulator. Oh, fuck. this ah there you go <laughs> that was something. I was gonna find. Uh, finish it. Assassin's Creed timeline? Nice. 
Okay, uh, I have the PS2 version of Gundam Muso 2. Yeah, I played that version as well. Uh, I hate the dialogue heavy game, so I don't play Yakuza's. Understandable. I also played Naruto Ninja Impact a lot on my phone back when I don't have a console. Ah, uh, yeah, I mean, it's a PSP game, and not, not gonna lie, PSP games do. Uh, it's really fun to play on your mobile phone, especially when you have those um, uh, portable controllers. Like, you know, the, the, the side controllers, whatever it is called. You saw that jewel wielding from Ishida, though. Yeah, it was cool. Ah, we got a weapon. もがみよしあきはまたも日のごと上空を飛行していた宿命の対決を続けるイエスミツナリに全く相手にされなかったもがみ誘拐した前田松にも知らずのうちに逃げられたもがみそんなもがみよしあきの波乱に飛ぶ
Frozen Lance Rapier. I still want to know how this works. Ah, there we go. So you hit it once, mm, then hit square. Okay, that's how it works. Not a bad move. Probably this is one of my favorite uh, stage soundtracks in the game. Katsugigawa. Oh yeah, I agree. Basar stages look really cool. I'm inviting Chester Shimazu. It's a key stage in Bathar 2. It's chill. Gotta go to sleep. Alright. I'll see you later. JK. Have a nice rest, buddy. Oh, my, my sleeping schedule is messed up as well. Kumuru Vampire, don't worry. You're not the only one. Dangerous here. Yeah. That was close.
我が輩の名は素敵天使ザビードン教の一員にして大幹部だよ Hello, keep in mind. Ah,、uh, glad, to,、uh, glad to see you finally here, buddy. Oh, oh damn. Devil Kings? Yeah, Devil Kings not a bad game. It's just,、uh, it's not like, it's not as、uh, good as the games that came after it. Don't worry, I'm just stopping by to support. I left my putty mouth at Sega Stream. Alright, it is what it is. Hey, Sega Saturn o k e n welcome. Dro I dropped a like, I love you. <laughs> okay, there. Let's not go that far. I love you all equally as a,、um, as once a、uh, great harem protagonist of anime said, I love you all equally. Alright, let's take out Unishige. Chainsaw man here. Careful. 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 Thanks for dropping by, Sega. <laughs> Mishige Ayakawa. Man, this man, m u n e s h i g e s tanky. One by chewing. Hello, Tim Bannon. Welcome. When is she just not having any of your shaky shit? Alright then.
エゾヒグマに決まりました。Not gonna have myself be defeated by. Ah, I can't even speak. I'm taking down Chainsaw Man here. Oh, damn. Oh, he's powering up. Better run. Close. Run, run, run. Your character got that Ichabod train body build? Nishiaki? Uh, God damn it, I, I need to be careful with Munishige. Fuck this ninja clown! Oh, he's powered up. Ichi! No, 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 I'm dead. We try. Sleepy Hollow build? Clown Ninja, yep. Yeah. I got screwed by a clown ninja. Yeah, he has Nagamasa's spear from uh, Summer Warriors. Except smaller. Rip. All right, let's try this again. No worries. Yeah, ninjas are aggressive in Basara. Even back during the PS2 days. Wait, really? There's a game in the arcades called Ninja Clowns? That's funny. No memory? Oh my zombie! Basari kegare naki jinpaku no tenshi! So! God, these ninjas are so annoying. Dude ain't lying, it's a beat em up. Yeah, it is. Uh, this game is made by the same. Uh, if you like Devil May Cry, you should try this game. This is from the same developer as Devil May Cry. It is a Capcom game. 
おんにおったこれは翼我が輩をここに導いた奇跡の翼だよザビードンも God, that damage is crazy. ザビードン一体誰かなザビードンは真っ赤とありがたき愛の伝道師 I have to uh... Oh, oh, you mean Ninja Clowns is a beat em up game? Well, I know there's Ninja Baseball Batman. I didn't know there was Ninja Clowns. I I'll see. Uh, I'll check it out later. The dude is tanking my attacks, damn it. My man, Zabi, someone of you may you not sort of tea. How in the world is he tanking my attacks? These are your favorite type of uh, games? One of them, yeah. I, I, I like a lot of games. This is one of them. My, how in the world is Yoshihiro tanking my attacks? Alright, let's try this again. Okay, this, this, would, this would take a while. I played a lot of like Japanese exclusive games and this is one of them. The last time I won uh, on this stage is with uh, Tarakatsu. Uh, and it's Tarakatsu, of course. Nagamasa Azai is in this game? No. Nagamasa is in, not in this game. Hello, Joel. He is in Basara 4, though. Well, Yoshihiro, yeah, yeah, good point. Yoshihiro's uh, sword weights more than <laughs> Yoshiaki's entire body. That's a good point. Damn, these ninja clowns. Get the hell out of my way. Yeah. 
喧嘩も勝った試しなし奥が大将やればいいのにあらこんにちは No, you don't. One down, three more to go. Ah, darn it, it's a trap. Yeah. 
帰ったら布団取り込まんと前日宗重様が破れた装束を塗ってくれました海向こうの文化にも見習う点はありますね素敵紳士の香りを嗅ぎたまえよいしれたまえまったく持っていい香りだねああこりゃもうぼやいてる場合じゃないね橘様はな雑念とは無縁のお方なのだまことの心とむやみにさらしてはならぬも。忘れませんように。汁かけ飯にしよっとわしだって結構我慢してると思うんだけどなよいしれたまえまったく持っていい香りだねまた悪いこと考えてしまったわしのバカバカダンピーズ・リレントレスこのままじゃうちの量外国になりかねえよ何としても屋敷だけはわびさび死守せんと。いらっしゃい。あなたのお金は私のもの。で、無理しげ、actually scary right now。強そうな人だな。よし、本気で行こう。I'm gonna, I'm gonna be here all day, am I? <sighs> Damn, when Ishige is annoying. I know. Waga Hai to Yeba Koki, the Jushina stood at Tayona. So Yeba Sura or Tom de Kitayona Koki, the Jushini Sura or Tom. Waga Hai Tenshi. Good pursuit, Tachibana. Not to, yeah, not to mention, he has Lu Bu's voice. You know that, Tetsu. Alright, that's not pursuit, Tachibana. No memory? Oh, my zombie! Masa ni kegare na ki jumpaku no tenshi! So!
いた天使本領だこれは翼我が輩をここに導いた奇跡の翼だよジャビードンもおまはんを見たら喜びよるザビードン一体誰かなジャビードンはまっことありがたき愛の伝道師近頃はとんと姿を見とらんがの伝道師我が輩もそう呼ばれていたようなともかくザビー教に入るがよか楽しかよザビー道教に入るおまはんならあっちゅうまに幹部いるね幹部あいザビー道教素敵き天使ああ我が輩のすべての記憶がつながっていくよあなたの洗礼名はサメ肌に決まりましたはいオーケーよい知れたまえまったく持っていい香りだん今はそうもいかないよね。This Munishige fight makes me wish I can play as Kanetsugu. Yeah. Yes, I equip defense, I do believe. Oh, uh, we can do this. Grandpa Yashiro is just that ripped. I'm going to tell you about it. 
いつからか人は我が輩をデキペースと呼んだ我が君ソーリン様とはどういうご関係このヒゲのように素敵な関係さいらっしゃいあなたのお金は私のものザビードン卿があるのは我が輩のおかげ将軍図が高いよ憧れの的ダビー様は言いましたお前じゅうなんて呼ばないでおスイーツメイいいね。Two things from my father the lightning edge and too much defense. Ah,、uh, not more ninja clowns.
死の香りを嗅ぎたまえ何としても屋敷だけはわびさび死守せんと全く持っていい香りだねいただくよ強そうな人だなよし本気でいこう新ザビー教第11回絶品じゃなくてキーですサビー様からどんな教えを受けたのですかうん教え教え思い出しザビーの奥に愛の神髄を教えたんだっけねザビー様に愛を説くとは素敵天使先生ザビー教愛の幸福感を教えたんだっけねえザビー教愛の幸福感を教えたんだっけねえザビー教愛の幸福感を教えたんだっけねえザビー教愛の幸福感を教えたんだっけ Everyone is just damn tanky in the stage. お前さんに小生の気持ちがわかるか我が輩は素敵天使いや超素敵ヒゲ天使先生超素敵ヒゲ天使先生バカじゃないのかハローマスターゴンズ、ウォーカムウォッチミサファーというデスステージ我が輩が洗礼名をつけてあげよう。超不運、連鎖大凶男でどうかな。超不運、連鎖大凶男。頭でも打ったのか。これで軽やかに飛び出したまえ。超上品、鋭利付けヒゲ三号自動羽ばたき版だよ。こ,このヒゲであの鳥を終えるのか。お前さんのヒゲ、全然止めないじゃないか。この嘘つきが。信者が増えることネズミさんのことしよこの鉄球につけた可愛らしい名前をな育児ってやつは大凶しかないんだ吉とか小吉なんて迷信だ迷信けなみに良い知れたまえ
まったく持っていい香りだねガシャウマニア生まれたくないもんだねの気持ちを考えてくれ少しでいいから逃げの生えた天使にあっちへ連れて行かれますよおらわれたまえ調整にも欲しいものはあるんだよ前さんの方がよほど真っ暗だガチャ Only sorry in this left Oh, let's finish sorry in うまい黒金を食らうこったなあ、あとはロチ OK, this is getting This is getting from funny to annoying real quick. ザビー様に愛を説いた先生そうでしょ何を言っているのかね我が輩は王子を住めるため Well, luckily, ウレシゲ doesn't decide to pursue me all the way here That would be really, really suck ひどく間の抜けた顔だね僕を騙したばかりかザビー様まで冒涜をコーラが我が輩の魅力に惹かれたのだろう上等な玄米茶で迎えるのが礼儀だよなんと気仙な手柄出産やりませんすべて嘘だったのですねザビ教援の前に落ちてきて自然性 I never imagined listening to Bossar dialogue would be annoying right now Shut up shut up shut up shut up shut up アンチンなところを間違わないように我が輩の門下生ザビードン君はどこかねなんて無礼なザビー様ですザビー様、死ぬのある響きです。わがはいの国はここよりずいぶん美しい。My God, non-stop! しかも、わがはいは大好きな人気者。ザビー教国こそ、この世の理想教育。これからさらなる高みへと登っていくのです。ママ君。Right, time to finish that little ship. Gotcha! Ugh, finally! Now everyone can shut up. Be right back. Zabi Kyo Kyo Ni, Dai 231 Sets. Stick Tenshi o Kataru Mono Ni wa Kibishik. 232節欧州短大にはすごく厳しく233節最上義明には最上級のお仕置きを<笑>サビー様を愚弄する舌先さんずの大嘘つきお仕置きですどこへでも飛んでいきなさい3 2 One, Sabi Fire!
よ我が輩の超真空流星はやぶさ号戻ろう我が輩たちの素敵な国へよしあきとみとあわせてくんぷり。よんどいつおにつみせいじゅす。よんどいつおにつみせいじゅす。よんどいつおにつみせいじゅす。It took me almost an entire hour just to finish that stage. Alright, time for Hideaki. Hopefully, he's not as bad as、uh, Hishiaki. s e t o u c h i no Choryu o Gakko Suru, Hitotsu no Utsuwa ga a t t 一寸法師のごとくその器じみた船を漕ぐのは小早川軍総大将小早川秀明かねてより憧れる伝説のあれを求め初めての一人旅に出たのであった天下の一品ああ胸がグツグツドキドキするよ彼は乱世の潮流をも確実に逆行していた金吾さん道中の方々に。私が一方を入れておきますね。安心して良き一人旅を。<笑>小早川秀明、野島を喰らう。Oh, we started at Noshima. Suruhime stage. Oh, okay, we're fighting Murachika. I thought we were fighting Suruhime. You know what? I want to buy a weapon. I want to get this quick. I want to finish this quick. Actually, I'm not too fun with his moveset, but it is kind of funny. They're making a robot.
<laughs> Beetle Boy can stop a meter by being clumsy. And he, of all people, has a timing mechanic while with pressing triangle during the flash effect on his pan. Oh, 
ソカベグンとクリアあれだろあれですね兄貴私の故郷だ夢と希望と金をつぎ込んだあれだよあれ夢と希望とお宝満載ですね兄貴海賊一味の皆さんゴミを捨てないでくださいおもちゃならずも粗大ゴミとは言ってくれるぜ何度でも言います燃えない粗大ゴミやるぞ好きなだけ暴れな俺が許す兄貴やるぞとは言ってみろとんでもねえもん作っちまったぜやろうぞ次は言ってみろ近頃私たちを真似する軍が増えていますのよやろうぞかわいってみろ簡単に壊すんじゃねえぜバカよてれるるんあれば最悪どうにかなるよねお任せくだされケンカにはおいしいものとまずいものしかないのに。あれがないとな兄貴ほら私の故郷から出て行きなさいそもそもてめえが俺を海賊呼ばわりするのが悪いんじゃねえかそれはこっちのセリフです喧嘩を売ってきたのはそっちです白い箱で育った嬢ちゃんが海の荒くれなめんなよ荒くれ者なんて古いです時代は鮮烈で鮮明で涼しげな男性ですうらせえこの田舎者が悪い口なんてこと大自然の申し事をおっしゃいなこの世で一番海が似合う男は This proof set is really his old everywhere.
この世で一番強い男は兄貴Man, he's just as annoying as Naotora in some of our warriors. Sure. Well, I hope not.
戻れやしねえ分かりきっていたことだったかふん<笑>あんたが鬼の罪をさらってくれるのかいやってみな嵐のように俺の後悔を連れ去ってくれやりました弱虫キングさん見直しましたどうどうじゃおうキング<笑>僕の勝負の使い切ったよ頑張れキングさん負けるなキングさんなんか食欲なくなってきたかも。ちょっと壁さえどこどこかいです。僕は伝説のあれが食べたいだけなんです。伝説のあれ。まさか古いのあの兵器か。キングさん素敵。僕はどうしても伝説のあれが食べたいんだ。戦国美食会の名にかけて。戦国秘書会。まさか空を飛ぶのか。ほら、こういう船って、もしれ。赤月丸を元にして。金はかかりそうだな。戦国美食会は、ツーの集まりなんです。戦国美食会。短い歌は何だってんだ。あの方や。にっこりとした。あの方や。大阪通りたくなってきただけなのに。三成君にぶたれたくなかっただけなのに。これなら三成くんにぶたれた方がああやっぱりやだ<笑>さかまく僕は戦国の隠し味になりたいんだ<笑>どこまでやるのは<笑>かはなんだ勝負に出てくるのは俺だけだ。味が変わるんだよ<笑>天下には美味しいものとまずいものしかないのに。<笑>Two more stages to go before I end the stream. Let's make this quick. Kobayakawa Hideaki によって意外にも破壊されたカラクリ兵器その修理に必要な材料を求め、長宗壁元親は、サイカ孫一の元へと舵を切った。やるぞサイカのところに行くぜんなんだ今の音別に、ほら、行くぞそう、船内に小早川が潜んでいるとも知らず。伝説のあれ、早く飛べたいよ。小早川秀明。Let's see how,、uh, how much my patient wears out. 
Alright, my Goichi stage. Let's see how long my patience can run. Alright, Magoichi stage. の<笑> あの、僕小早川秀明って言います。勇者小早川。お前の名は聞いてる。これほど早く会える。天海様、ここにも手紙出してくれたんだ。ねえ、誰かさ、この辺りの美味しいものを教えてよ。勇者を確認。常にもマ
てなしか一人旅の醍醐味だよね大悟も団子も美味しいよね<笑>ビリリとしてない勇者、正面から本陣へ進行中うわ何これどういうことを敵方が上か認めようそれが真実だ彼らはそれを歓迎しようもうやめない僕の負けでいいよ Nice! You're almost get done getting a Sumeragi Platinum Nice! Sumeragi is such a good game
しいよね我らは死を恐れゆえに我らは強い羽ばたく手合いだ翼の根を打ち止めろ我らがここまで追い詰められるとは。ハフハフしてマグマグしたいな武将である前に食べるお客でありたいんだ今はお前に風がそういうこと OK Let's finish this お前は何人目の我らを前に屈する This is getting exhausting また手合わせを願おう。ああ、手と手を合わせていただきます。我らの誇りを平らげようと。いい覚悟だ。兵力損害警備。展開を続行する。誇り高き勇者よ。我ら傭兵との契約を望むか。傭兵の契約？焼き鳥か。ダメを放置することは我らのはずだ回った時によろけないのが目標なんだ前は死を恐れるか痛み勇者小早川秀明なぜ我らを選んだなぜって美味しそうな鳥ののれんがあるし我らの象徴をうまそうなどとあざけるか誇りを重んじぬ者は勇者にあらずと知れ
もてなしはまだ。我らのもてなしでは物足りないか。お父さん。いや、勇者。ヒーロー。その程度の力では赤い金はならぬぞ。赤い金。赤い金の専門家。僕は僕は全部食べるんだ。絶対マグマグしてみ
What does that do, honestly? I rarely play as Hideaki. the dish to get it uh get more power You don't have the his Dango Race R2, it's actually possible to beat Masamune with it.
He would march out. Horsemanship that makes march out stand in awe. Well, even Hideaki is fanboying over Kojiro. I mean, he is the best boy for a reason. わかんないの運動ってこんなに必要なの気を抜くなよ。明日のドローを浴びてか。え、王子はドローも美味しいのマグマグ。マグマグ。まさに食うじゃねえ。味付けが足りないよ。もう限界。お腹と背中がくっつい
あんたの家臣が手紙に書いたことだ多分間違ったんです天界様が西軍総大将で戦国ビクトリー俺を差し置き天下目前ってわけか天界様これ取り返しつくの嘘ですお腹空いてつい人間の一体欲は食欲戦う欲じゃないよ<笑>なぜ負けてまで戦うか俺が龍だからさ<笑>デッドオーデス好きな方を選びな随分といい顔で笑うじゃねえかあんた。悪かったな何も戦うことはなかったかもしれねえ<笑>俺はあんたをやろうとしていたあんたのヒット騒がせな家臣の手紙を読んでな<笑>て天外様小次郎腕を振るってやれはい食っていくかは,はいここれが日本を駆け巡りようやくたどり着いた小十郎さんの手作り鍋<笑>いただきまーすマグマグおいしくて幸せでおいしいかわいい子には旅をさせろですね。<笑>アニメを見つけたら、ヒデアキー。ヒデアキー。We got the Takeda Shingen. And we got a tag team mode. Tenkai enjoying this role playing a bit too much.、Mm -hmm. But on the good side, Cher, I'm finally done with、uh, the hero story for Basar Thu Tage. Then I don't have to play Hideaki anymore. Yeah, that, I think that's enough of, <coughs> enough of Hideaki right now. So, yeah,、um, the next stream, I'm gonna play as the six characters of Conquest Mode Kenshin, Shingen, Kasuga, Matsu, Toshi, and Ujimasa. So, look forward to that. Then I can finally、uh, take a break from Sega Basara streams for a while and go play other games. and... When the time is、uh, right, I'm gonna go back to Sego Basara Force of Muragi, the best Basara game as of right now, right? So, thank you so much for joining in the stream, ladies and gentlemen. I'm actually getting tired right now. And, <laughs> yeah, I have no other words to say. If you like this、uh, stream, give it a thumbs up. If you 
I haven't subscribed to this channel, do subscribe to the channel, it's absolutely free. Subscribe to my second channel as well, Party People for Our Playthroughs, and I'll see you guys in the next stream or video. Ta-ta!